It says I'm 15 years old going into 16 and I'm currently generating 3K a month from my agency, making 36K a year. You are making more money than all the teachers from the state on average. Whenever you get to 10K a month, DM me. I'll give you a free one-on-one -on -one hour of my time. I'm in no rush, right? I'm sitting on tens of millions of dollars. Guys, I'm fucking retired. Do you understand that? I'm retired. First of all, do you think it's too late to try and start an FBA business? You don't go into something to try, okay? You do not go into something to try. You either do it or you don't. Is it too late? It's never too late. I know people that are doing five to $10 million a month on Amazon, but they've been sell selling on that shit for a decade, right? I mean, that's who you're competing up against. It's very combative with a lot of this train of thought regarding margins and splitting traffic and then giving a cut to Amazon. Just dealing with a ton of nonsense that you wouldn't have to deal with otherwise, right? I like being independent because at any moment, Amazon can tell you to fuck off. What do you do? You have no customer base, you have no email, no information, nothing. If you're a brand, however, okay, and you have your own e-commerce store, I highly recommend selling on Amazon because it's basically free traffic. Uh, that would be my recommendation for Amazon, but I would I would channel my strength elsewhere. You know, you can run your own, your own brand and right now you could literally run TikTok organic, right? And everybody talks about it and, oh yeah, I've heard about it. But what have, what have you fucking done? Have you started a TikTok organic store? Probably not, so shut the fuck up. The point is TikTok organic today is still very much explosive. Like guys, you could have zero fucking dollars to your name, right? Zero dollars. Let's say you got a credit card or whatever. You get your Shopify subscription, you get your TikTok account, you get a 3PL, which is a third party logistics company that offers and does your, your shipping and your handling and all that. And you could literally start drop shipping, bro. Find the fucking product or Order it or take content that's generic on the internet, repost that shit, have a good website on Shopify that is literally designed to sell just a lander. You don't even need Shopify. You could get literally just a basic lander. Check out, done, start fulfilling orders. You could literally do it. But the thing is you don't fucking want it that bad, bro. You don't want it. You're a comfortable motherfucker. You like to eat shit, scroll and repeat. That is your life. Eat shit, scroll, repeat. So don't come to me. I don't want to hear a complaint from anybody. If you're not sitting on tens of fucking millions of dollars, you cannot say shit to me. Nothing, nada, zip. Shut the fuck up, okay? That's the, that's the name of the game. Sit down, little boy, pull out a pen and a paper, and listen. Everybody's arrogant. You have nothing to be arrogant about in your life. You've accomplished nothing. You've accomplished zero in life. Oh, I got a college degree. I, I was I proved that I could memorize books for four years. Oh, I got a 4.0 GPA in high school. What did you get? Buck school. I had a kid DM me today on Instagram, bro. I was going to post it. I literally just pulled it up. I was actually going to post it. I'll read it to you guys. It says, hi, Luke. I've been watching a lot of your videos as you're an entrepreneur. I thought I would, I would see if it's a good question to ask you. I'm a subscriber to your channel. It says, I'm 15 years old going into 16 and I'm currently generating 3K a month from my agency. When did you, when do you think it's the right point to leave school? Bro, first of all, if you're 15, bro, and you're making three Gs a month, I fucking commend you, bro. I fucking commend you. What I want to look up is... You're in fifth, you're, in, you're, what, what is it? If you're 15, you're in like ninth grade, 10th grade. Let's just do high school teacher salary. So let's say you're making right now three grand a month. You should be able to scale that shit to, let's go to ZipRecruiter. Okay, so the average person, I don't know what state you're in, but if you're in Nevada, some of these more expensive states in New York, you're making 42K a year. On the lower side, right? On the lower side, you're making 36K a year. You are making more money than all the teachers from the state on average. And you're fucking 15. Why the fuck would you be in school? Do you understand why the fuck would you be in school? To learn from some fucking clown on, on like to study rocks or fucking flags or some shit? Like that's what you're gonna do? Enough, wake the fuck up. Hit the like button, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and get started. Shout out to the 15 year old. I'm very proud of you. I'm very proud of you, young man. Oh no, and then, and then you know what he asked me at the bottom, he says, or should I focus on my exams? Why the fuck would you focus on your exams, bro? Go scale that that business from three to six. Do the exact same thing you were doing, just double it. Very simple, just double what you already done. Whether it's output of work, whether it's doubling your clients, whether whatever, do that shit ASAP. Whenever you get to 10K a month, DM me. I'll give you a free one-on-one -on -one hour of my time. If if you do it before 16 though, if you're 16, you're already too old. You should be making 10, 10 grand a month if you're 16. All right, W to the 15 year old kid. Ladies and gentlemen, we got 450 people in chat. Post this on your on your Instagram, tag me. Um, let's get started. 
So if you're eating, shitting, scrolling, and repeating, get the fuck out of my chat. I don't want you here. I don't want to see your face. I don't want to hear about you. Most people that wake up and walk around like accidents, they can't fathom. They can't fathom that there's people that are there out there worth tens of billions of dollars that are actually smart as fuck, controlling the narrative, controlling the perspective of the world. They can't fathom that, right? They, it, it, it can't enter in their fucking small peewee brains. That life isn't just chance, right? You can't just wait for circumstances to happen to you. Circumstances are created. They're just happening to you because you're not the one in fucking control. Now you can't control everything in life, but you can control a lot of it, bro. But a lot of you guys are waking up, walking around like accidents. Bro, I don't know what I'm doing in life. I don't know what I'm doing in life. Have you sat down and fucking thought? Have you picked up a damn book? Have you like actually gone and hung out with people that are more successful than you? Or are you hanging out with the same bullshit ass friends that you've had since fucking middle school? All these broke fucking motherfuckers. These are the people you're hanging out with. What do you expect? I have to repeat these things every single day because people are forgetful. People are forgetful. Oh yeah, but the shit that you teach is, it's very basic. Are you doing it? Are you doing, oh no, I I'm above the basic shit. I'm above the basic shit. Earn your fucking joint, bro. Earn your joint, dude. I had a million fucking dollars in my bank account before I even tasted what cannabis was, bro. A million fucking dollars, bro. Renting out fucking Airbnbs for 10 grand a week, 15 grand a week while everybody was masked up during the pandemic. Like, <sighs> Everybody, bro. So, let's be real here. Let's be fucking real and get a grip of your damn life, bro. Get a grip of your damn life. Because if you don't, somebody else will control your life.